Hi guys, if I look tired, I've literally been making content all day. Right now, it's 20 past 1 in the morning. Uh, I am a night owl, especially when I have things I need to do. This is my new dress that I've got. It's cute. So the other day I went to Anne Summers. This was the day after I went to see Pierce the Veil in Manchester. I went to shop the next day. Uh, I got quite a few things. And I got this Christmas dress. It's got this belt on it, but it's kind of like off right now. I've been really wanting a velvet red dress and I couldn't find one on the internet but that, that I liked. Um, but I went to Penn Summers and I saw that dress and I was like, I need to get that. So this was £32 and it's um, a UK size 8 to 10. I had gotten a smaller size but when I tried it on in the changing room, it just was really tight and it was more like a top than a dress. Um, the material's not very stretchy so I got a size up. And it fits me pretty good. Now this video is going to be about the Builder Bear that I got when I went to Build a Bear in Manchester on that day that I also went to Anne Summers after Pierce the Veil. Uh, but you'll see why I'm gonna wear this dress later in the video. I'm also wearing it because it's like Christmassy and it's Christmas in five days. Well, technically four days now because it's 1am. You actually can wear this without the belt. So you can wear it like that. I actually kind of prefer it like this, but and the belt like looks like this. I guess it's more like a Santa Clausy with the belt. It looks definitely more like a costume with the belt on, which isn't a bad thing. But I feel like without the belt, um, it looks more pretty. Like this is the kind of thing. I would want to wear on Christmas day when I'm decorating the tree. The belt's good for like showing off your body, kind of like it sucks. You know, like it shows how small a waist is, but I kind of prefer it a little bit flowy. Now, I also went to Clinton's the other day, like a couple of days ago. I got Christmas cards. I also found These reindeer ears for £3.99 with like a nose on it as well. Um, I realised that these would be very fitting for the video. You will see why. It's fitting because of Christmas but there'll be another reason why. And it has this like nose thing on as well. Let me try this on. I'm not going to keep this on because it looks weird. But it's funny for the video. I'm putting it on like the most difficult way possible right now. This is like the most dressed up I've ever been for Christmas. I never usually dress up like this for Christmas. It's kind of fun. Okay, so on to the actual main part of the video. So, the day after I went to Pierce the Veil, I went to Build a Bear. And I heard about Build a Bear when I was younger. And I really wanted to go to it, but it's uh, too expensive for me when I was a kid and I bought this for myself the other day it was really really cute and he's called Winter I decided to pick the reindeer because well it's Christmas and I have a thing where I'm really passionate and obsessed with events so I like go all out when it's like Christmas, Halloween my birthday and stuff it's like bad for money but I don't know actually why I do it but I, I like celebrated Halloween for the whole month and I basically celebrated Christmas for the whole month as well and I started celebrating in November uh, I'm getting a little bit obsessive when it comes to events but that's what makes me happy at the moment so I was told I was gonna get um, a, a, a brown bear instead because I was like when I think of build a bear I think of an actual teddy bear with like clothes on because when I first went into the shop I was like wait is this just like 
you pick the skin of the teddy and then it gets stuffed and there's no clothes but I saw they did do clothes so the other day I went to get these reindeer uh, antlers I think they're called and it's because I watched a TikTok of these like two girls dancing in Christmas ones he's wearing reindeer antlers and I was like I want to get some of those but then just before I was making this I was about to make this video I realised that the reindeer antlers and uh, winter right here is a reindeer so we are actually matching right now so let's put the nose on win winter it doesn't fit because his face is so small Holy. there is winter cosplaying as Rudolph the red nosed reindeer he looks so cute Right now, Winter is wearing this like Christmas onesie. It's got candy canes on it. That was like Winter's fur coming off, and I thought it was a spider because my glasses aren't on, so it kind of like shit me up. But yeah, this onesie is so cute. And literally, like it comes down here, and it looks so cute. And it has a hole for his tail as well. It's so cute. So I'm going to take his onesie off because you've already seen him in his onesie. Like, i got multiple clothes for him. I haven't actually dressed winter in a while. Um, yeah. When I went into, when I was getting this teddy stuffed, well obviously I helped to stuff it. The, whatever they use to stuff teddies, plushies with. Um, and... I asked the woman there if it's if it's a new place. That's when it was out the onesie on. So cute. <laughs> I love him. I actually like sleep at night with him, like every night. This morning I woke up and I was cuddling winter. Like he's just so nice and soft to cuddle. I asked the woman, um, is Elder fairly new? She said actually it's the twenty it's the twenty fifth anniversary, so you're around twenty five years and when I went into Build a Bear for the first time, they had been celebrating the 25th anniversary and they've actually got, um, I looked the other day, they've got like Swarovski bears, which is cool because I've been looking at like Swarovski bracelets to get on them for a birthday and stuff, and then I saw they do Swarovski Build a Bear, so I was like, that's cool. They have one for like £1,750, and like there's other Swarovski ones for cheap, like 70 75 which is alright. Yeah, the bears are quite expensive, but is really worth it, the experience. Um, if you're into this kind of stuff, I really, I've always liked plushies and teddies, like, since I was a kid. And I can be quite, um, childish sometimes, like, playful. I like, still doing stuff I did as a kid, like, cuddling teddies to sleep. I don't know. Winter has, um, the extras that I got for winter are a sound. So, I always think it's this one to press, because it's got the B.A.B sign which means build a bear on the pole but it's actually no it's not that one this one it makes this sound it's like a jingle bell sound it's so cute it's literally so cute sometimes i like forget the winter exists when i'm like stressing throughout the day and then i like sit on winter accidentally and that sound will just be there and I'm like, oh, it's winter. Winter also has, um, I found this out the other day. Um, a heart. So I knew it already had a heart inside of it, like its chest, yeah? The other day, um, I found out that winter had a heartbeat because this person was like cuddling winter and he was like, and he was like, oh my gosh, like when it's got a heartbeat, I was like, what? So yeah, you could cuddle. I don't know if you hear that. I'll put it like close to the camera. If you like press down, it's just where the heart is. And it has a heartbeat to make it more like interactive and more personal. It's so cute. Yeah, it's like vibrating, you can feel it against your fingers and 
and you can hear the sound of its heartbeat so that is so nice and um it also has a scent in it so it smells really nice it's a birthday cake scent and um the one that asked like what's um if we want the scent and i said yeah and then i asked her um, what will the scent be and she said birthday cake and i was like hmm well it's not really christmasy but that was the only scent there so i got it anyway uh ironically my birthday is actually like oh just so, uh, just over a week after christmas so it's on the 3rd of january um and then i realized like when i bring winter with me on holiday for my birthday like winter will be smelling of birthday cake so not only is winter like a christmas themed gift he's also like a birthday themed gift for me because my birthday is around christmas time and i just find that so cute like i'll be eating my birthday cake whilst winter is smelling of birthday cake and because i like things like that like events and themes and stuff um i'm a little bit autistic and maybe it's not because of autism maybe that's just my personality but i just like stuff like that um like i look at his face sometimes and like it's so cute like if you take all of his fur away from his eyes like his eyes look so big they're like dying out of his head but then i kind of like that because it looks a bit cute when they're a bit more hidden um i'm thinking of doing like a miss close cosplay with uh winter um doing like a photo shoot and then doing like a set and then selling that to people that want it don't know if that's going to happen yet because I've got a lot to do but if it happens, it happens. Um, it would just be cool because it's like uh, Santa Claus on his sleigh of reindeers. It's like me, it's like Mrs. Claus, me, uh, with my reindeer here. I just like feeling like the text is really nice. So I'll show you all the clothes that I got for winter and show you his birth certificate. I've decided it's a he and um... He looks like a he to me. And I will tell you how much everything costs and everything because I know people like nosy about stuff and I like knowing the price of stuff too. Like it's just human nature you like nosy about stuff. Apparently Build a Bear is becoming really popular. Like people probably have been going on about Build a Bear on like social media and stuff. I just like it because I love teddies and so the ultimate teddy is like a Build a Bear teddy. You know you can make your own, personalise it and it's really personal you actually i'm getting like a, i have like a little attachment to my teddy i know it's not real but it's like when i'm sleeping alone at night and stuff it's nice to cuddle it and it's so soft and the heartbeat makes you feel like it is a little bit real you, you know it's not but you know what i mean so with uh winter basically i've got a video um on the 8th of december where on the 9th of december where i'm um I put my foot down on the thing to help uh, stuff winter with all the stuff that you put to like make it come to life and then you do like this kind of like ritual type thing, I don't know what it's called where you like tapping your forehead and doing all this like cute stuff to like make, make the builder bear come to life and yeah I got this drawstring bag, you can either get it in like a box or a bag you have to pay a little bit extra for the bag um, I decided to get the Christmas themed bag of course I wanted it to be as Christmassy as possible so I got a lot of clothes, birth certificate. Um, they rolled it up so it's like this. If it was up to me it would be like laminated so it wasn't like creased and yeah. Build a bear workshop, birth certificate, date of birth, December 9th, 2022. Full name, winter, height, 27 centimeters, weight, 226 grams. Eye color, brown, fur color, medium brown, belongs to Kyra and it says 25 years of hearts and hogs, which is cute for the 25 year anniversary. That's what the birth certificate looks like. I'll show you like all the clothes laid out so you can see them all before I put them on winter. Before I do that, I'm just gonna show you one thing. I had some sort of clothing that I got, um, which tells you why I'm wearing this dress. So you know how I said that I went to Anne Summers? I went to Anne Summers like before I went to build a bear and got this dress. Well, when I went to build a bear, um, the person who was with me um, was looking at clothes and he said, Oh, you two could be matching this, that dress. Well, he pointed out 
a very very similar dress the one that I had just bought and some is so I thought that is really cute I'm definitely getting that like that's why I put the belt back on because now we are really are matching the red velvet dress with the uh, white stuff underneath it and the belt is just so so cute so I thought that me and Winter could match for Christmas hence the velvet dress and the reindeer antlers so I did get Winter on the 9th of December which now it's the 21st of December because it's um 1.53am precisely I've had Winter for 12 days however I've not taken the tags off yet because I wanted to show him uh, to you guys because I'm basically making content creating my full time job and so anything I buy I like to make content with it now because it like makes back money and it makes back uh, followers and well I just like showing stuff I've got and I can inspire other people and like somebody else might go to build a bear now and just be like really happy so there's winter and winter's clothes and winter's birth certificate and drawstring bag let's take a look at his clothes so got the dress got the velvet dress because it matches mine and it's really Christmassy so I would have bought it anyway for winter got this dress because it's like a Christmas nightgown so winter can wear that to like party or go to sleep in because it's kind of like a nighty isn't it but it's also like a night dress like a party dress uh winter's onesie so you can sleep and that'll be comfy um by the way i might sound like a weirdo now talking like this about this stuff teddy but trust me if you guys got a build a bear you would start doing the same inanimate objects will not hurt you i think it's an inanimate object <laughs> i had to research that if it is uh, my voice is going because i'm i think i'm ill got this christmas top and it came with this it came with this scarf i got a tutu because like it needed went to needed pants to go with the top and got these boots because the person who i was with like said they're cute and i was like oh i'm gonna get these boots now because you like them and i think that's cute so winter like the tutu and the boots are kind of like alternative stuff he's like fashion sense right now is christmas an alternative just like mine we love that for winter <laughs> so far winter's tried on the onesie and the christmas jumper with the scarf the tutu and the boots winter's not tried on uh this red satin dress and the matching velvet dress that I have. Well, let's talk about prices. Winter was £22.50. He is classed as the buff check moose. I think that's a reindeer. Um, his birthday cake scent is £3.50. His sound was £5. I always forget which paw it's on. The drawstring is £4. His onesie was £9. His red dress was £7. I just realised that I called Winter a boy, however he has dresses. Um, oh well, he will still look gorgeous in these dresses. His Santa dress is £13.50. His snowflake jumper and scarf were £13.50. His sparkly tutu was £4.20. His black lace up boots were £6. The receipt says BAT tax, 20% 14 pounds 70 at my eyes twitching, sorry. I don't know what VAT tax is, all I know is that it charges extra. Um, altogether I paid 89 pound 20. Build bear does not have to be expensive, it's just if you get the extras. And because I got one, two, I paid for six different items of clothing and has seven different items of clothing. Because with the scarf as well. So yeah, if you want to be cheap, but like you don't have much money or you just don't want to spend that much over there, you can just get the build bear itself. What I really wanted is what like the person was, who was with me um, uh, pointed out to me the Jack Skeleton one. There was like a Jack Skeleton um, one that was already stuffed and it was too expensive at the time, but I really want to get that one. Like, I really love that one before Christmas. I'm like obsessed with it and it was really cute that he pointed it out to me. The person who I was with sent me £9 to get Winter's onesie, so thank you to that person.
So, winter's onesie, let's put that back on. So, you undo this. And, I mean, he has like four things to put in, so I got like this to make it easier. And then his foot puts in. Like, can I just say um, something that women really like when with what men do? Women, we really, well, many of us, we really like when men are thoughtful. So, like, say if, if, if you're a guy watching this and you have a girlfriend, I'm gonna give you the best advice I can give you her that will make your girlfriend love you even more than she already does. Um, go and go to build a bear and make a bear for her and like film it. She'll love it if you go like a lot because that shows you have balls to go into build a bear by yourself or even with your friend that makes you look even more balls because instead of your ego like you don't you, you you know guys have can sometimes have egos around the male friends well it shows you can show love for your girlfriend even when you're with your male friend or if you're if you're an anxious person you know or if you're introverted or you just don't want to go to the bar you can't whatever you can you can order one online so you could like just either go to build a bear get one for her and like gift it to her as a present don't tell her you've got it just literally gift it to her like wrap it up and just like leave it outside the door and then text like come to your door got something or um well, yeah, there's many ways you can surprise somebody but you could just like send it send it to her address just honestly if you do that that's like a woman's dream like her boyfriend going to build a bear and getting her to build a bear uh it's beautiful honestly for a woman female women perspective if uh i had a boyfriend if i had a boyfriend who went to build a bear and just like wrapped up and gifted it to me I would honestly cry and probably have a mini heart attack and love him and want to marry him then and there okay that I didn't even realise that winter was in the onesie that's winter in the onesie I already showed you that okay let's take that off and try his Christmas jumper around with a scarf
Thank you.